Hey folks, Crockett here. Sorry about the lousy quality of the video here, but I wanted to give you an update because I saw in the LinkedIn group there were a handful of uh, wonderful experimental hybrid hero folks that are looking at lighting, hybrid lighting for continuous light that allows us to shoot talking portraiture. All right. One of the experiments that I'm working on revolves around that CFL bulb that I talked to you about, right? This is it right here. And this is the $9, almost $10 bulb that we got at Home Depot, thanks to Suzette Allen and John Yoshinaga that told me, hey, well, you might want to test this and it's pretty good. So bottom line is when we use our crazy spectrum analyzer, we find out where this bulb's strengths and weaknesses are. We're also able to take a second bulb that has strengths in areas where this bulb is a little weak. This boosts up the kind of valleys that this spectral output response has. Now, this is just a $1.20 light bulb, right? This is uh, another one of the Home Depot brands, and once we get all these tests complete, I'll be glad to release all this information, right? So what we're doing is we're just experimenting here. So if I combine nine of these good bulbs with 12 of these bulbs and a little bit of color temperature orange gel. Might have to put a little magenta gel in there too in order to get rid of some of the green cast from some of these smaller bulbs. I'm able to get a pretty significant light quality at a very fair price. So look at what I made here. This is my crazy little test piece. This is called the Wayne Light 912. And once this all goes together, we're waiting on one more part to show up. This is gonna fit together here. It's got a nice aluminum face on there. I know, Louie, uh, our uh, assistant, is really great with building mechanical stuff. So this is going to hold uh, on the lower level here. This is a two-level system. It's gonna hold these low-end bulbs here. It's gonna hold 12 of those. Then we've got another part that's going to bring us a way to mount a second level of lights. Let me show you how that works. These are going to be five and a quarter inch little extenders, and I'll show you why that's important. So ultimately, we're going to have a light that's going to have, <laughs> there we go, is going to have 23 bulbs in it, not 12, 23, and that's going to give us the power that we need, right? Take a look at how this works. Well, the reason that this is really cool is this is going to fill up a light box. Our two by two soft box is going to be properly filled up by these lights. Why? Because they go sideways, right? Not that the LED does a horrible job, and I've got a two by two with an LED there, but it's very directional and we have to treat it very differently. But what if we want a low cost solution to get people shooting talking portraiture? And what if they can buy the bulbs themselves from Home Depot and other places too, we can find these online, I'll bet you even cheaper. And what I want to do is take this piece and I want to give it to one of the manufacturers that make this kind of stuff and have them make one to our specs. The one that Craig was showing from Photodiox, the fact that we don't like Photodiox and we don't trust their data. And by the way, we're not taking a shot at Photodiox. Uh, I've spoken to the folks over there. They seem to be okay folks. But when they're able to kind of work up to Crockett standards and have data that's actually accurate on the website, we'll be glad to work with them. Right? Doors always open. I want to take this, and I've got three manufacturers already interested in it, but I don't know if this is going to work yet or not. Allow us the rest of the week to get this fixed up and ready to go. This is a real proof of concept sample, and if it does work, I am going to make a little video on it, send it out to manufacturers, and see how quick they can get them made for us. Ideally, I would like to see a manufacturer not only make this, but make a case for it that holds bulbs, right? So that we can have talking portraiture on the go. This piece, looking at somewhere around with the light bulbs, $350 to $450 maybe. Keep our fingers crossed, right? Way to go. All right, just thought I'd give you a little update. Please hold off on buying any CFL light fixtures until I have a week, maybe two weeks max, to see if this is going to work or not work, okay? All right. Thanks from the secret laboratory. <laughs> Crockett World Headquarters. It's Crockett saying thanks. Bye.